In this video, we shall be looking at properties of a rectangle. So, a rectangle is a quadrilateral, that is, it has four sides. So, let's look at the nine properties of a rectangle. One, opposite sides are parallel. Two, opposite sides are equal. Three, all the angles are right angle. Four, opposite angles are equal. Five, consecutive angles are supplementary. Six, diagonals are equal. Seven, Diagonals bisect each other. The word bisect means it divides into equal halves. Eight. One pair of the sides are both congruent and parallel. Congruent means equal also. Nine. Each diagonal divides the quadrilateral into two congruent triangles. It means into two equal triangles. So, let's take a look are the properties one after the other one opposite sides are parallel so this side is parallel to this side and this side is also parallel to this side two opposite sides are equal what do i mean by this it means this side is equal to this and this side is equal to this means if a b line a b is equal to five centimeter c d will be also be five centimeter and if a c is three centimeter b d is three centimeter three All angles are right angles. Can you see? Yeah, they are all right angles. Can you see that? So, angles A, B, C, D are 90 degrees. A right angle is 90 degrees. And four, opposite angles are equal. So if angle A is equal to angle D and angle B is equal to angle C. So if angle A is 90 degrees, angle D is also 90 degrees. And also if B is 90 degrees, angle C is 90 degrees. 5. Consecutive angles are supplementary. What do I mean by this? It means angle next to each other. The addition is equal to 180. So, if I say angle A plus angle B, that's 90 plus 90 equals to 180 degrees. So, if you pick any two angles next to each other, you do the addition, you always get 180 degrees. Six, diagonals are equal. What do I mean by this? Let's see. So if I draw two diagonals across the rectangle, can you see what I'm doing? Okay. Can you see that? So if this diagonal is eight centimeter, the other diagonal is also eight centimeter too. That means the diagonal also are what equal. They have equal length. So, also, seven diagonals bisect each other. I said the word bisect means to cut into half. So, can you see that the diagonals cut through each other? It means it divides it into two equal halves. So, if this side is four centimeter, this is also four centimeter 
and if this is four centimeter also this is also four centimeter eight one pair of the size are both congruent and parallel it means congruent means equal so it means this side is equal to this side and at the same time parallel and if you check the other triangle too this is equal to this side and at the same time they are both parallel so you can't have both sides to be congruent and parallel at the same time that was why we said one pair of it are equal and what parallel so lastly number nine now each diagonal divides the quadrilateral into two congruent triangles congruent triangles means equal triangles so i have two triangles here so if i draw a line through this first rectangle what do i have i have two triangles so i have triangle q and triangle r and also if i draw a line through this a diagonal line now can you see i have two triangles triangle s and triangle t so the triangles i have are equal to each other so triangle q is equal to triangle r while triangle s is equal to triangle t